Races in behind these. They're followed by a Royal Performance dropping seven lengths off them. Piri Equatili races just in behind that one. Armed and dangerous back along their inside. They being followed by Helza Poppin who just moves past that. Racing about nine, ten lengths off this lead out. Further back to Sandy Lane in behind that one. Oreo Shake is back along the inside. And Dandy Man Can sees them all and he must be 20 lengths off this lead out. Hold on Tiger wins the battle for the lead as they head on down to the 1200 and Master Chi has gone up to race in second. Second. Surreptitious back of the rail is racing third. Up on their far side, it looks like Gold Mountain is covered and races three deep. Just in behind that one, Walton Heath is back between runners and four lengths off this leader. They being followed further back then by Titus in the pink silks who races about six lengths off them. Hammy's flyers at that one's girth the far side and then Pinotage Pete back seven off the lead. Piri Equatili in the yellow silks races next. They followed by Royal Performance. Hell's a pop and is eight or nine lengths off them. Armed and dangerous back along the inside. Sandy Lane races in behind that. They followed by Oreo Shake the blue so cap who races back one from last. And Dandy Man Can is still your trailer. They're at the top of the lane now and they head for home with just over 4.50 left to line. Hold on, Tiger brought the field for home. Gold Mountain quick to move in and challenge up on the outside. Armed and Dangerous is in behind those. They followed by Walton Heath who now starts to make a forward move. Titus between runners is kicking on nicely. Sandy Lane is in behind that one. Titus now comes forward to pick it up over towards the inside. He's running on strongly in the closing stages. Up towards the outside, Piri Equitillion. Walton Heath are trying to come back. Right down the inside, running on strongly too. It's Titus in front though. Titus stays on to win it. Pinotage Pete Flash.